Hello there, I'm Sebi from Holotech Studios, and in this video I will teach you how to import a background to the Animes Editor and export it to the Animes Mobile app so you can use it with any of your avatars. Backgrounds set the scene, allowing you to place avatars in a variety of different settings. We will be importing a sample background which you can download from our website to follow along. Go to animes.us slash editor and click download sample avatars. Now, let's get started. Open the Animes Editor on your PC. Take note of the hierarchy panel on the left side of the screen, the viewport in the center, and the editor panel on the right. To start importing your background, we need to locate it first. Click the Assets menu in the top left corner and select Import Skybox. Now go to Browse and navigate to your background's location. We're looking for a file called backgrounddeserttest.hdr, so go ahead and double click the file or select it and press Open. Then, check the Auto Generate Blurred Image option to add the blur effect to the skybox. This way your avatars will stand out in the scene while user's eyes will not be distracted by any background elements. And hit import. Great, we have successfully imported a custom background. Your background is now part of our default scene called customization01 underscore scene. Now, in order to differentiate it quickly and easily, let's generate a thumbnail for it before moving on. Click the scene's name in the hierarchy panel, then go to the top right corner of the editor panel. Right-click the square next to the scene's name and select Generate Thumbnail. Now, let's save our work by right-clicking the background's name in the hierarchy panel on the left and selecting Save Item. Don't forget to save your work, otherwise you won't be able to export it. All good so far, but before we move on, make sure the iPhone running the Animes app and the PC running the Animes editor are connected to the same Wi-Fi or LAN network. You'll also need access to our Artist Pass subscription in the mobile app. Ensure you have purchased the subscription before continuing. If you received the promo code for the Artist Pass, now is the perfect time to redeem it. Let's connect our devices. Go to Tools and select Local Connect. Now click Start and the editor will generate a QR code. The QR code will be displayed until you click the Stop button. For now, leave the QR code up. Next, open the Animes app on your iPhone. Tap the gear icon on the top right corner and select Restore Purchases to make sure your Artist Pass subscription is active. All you have to do now is tap the blue text that says Connect next to Connect to Editor point the iPhone's camera at the QR code, and that's it, we're now connected to the editor. You will see a confirmation message in both the app and the editor. Let's head back to the Animes editor, right-click on the background's name and select Send to Device. A pop-up will appear on your iPhone, so go ahead and tap Yes, and the file transfer will begin immediately. Once the transfer is complete, you'll once again see a confirmation message in both the app and the editor. To use your new background, tap the Backgrounds button on the home screen of the mobile app, then tap your imported background and hit the green check mark loaded. And here it is, ready to go. Why not record a quick video to show it off? Thanks for watching. I hope you found this tutorial helpful, and as always, if you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask them on our Discord server or email us at support at animes.us. All the best from everybody here at Holotech Studios.